what's up guys and uh, when I realized that when I did my review on my computer I didn't really do the boot up times and I was planning to so this is gonna be a separate video and I kinda like it being a separate video too because it attracts um, people wanting to know about uh, more about this SSD and it's the Kingston uh, SSD now 300 I think V300 V300 uh, v I believe um, so when I was looking, I was really excited. Usually when I'm really excited about things, I like to look at videos on it. Um, so, uh, I was looking at videos on it, and I really couldn't find that many about a Windows 8.1 boot-up shutdown um, on this particular SSD. So, I'm just going to show up, uh, start up by looking and showing you that I don't have a lot of programs running right now. I just have Norton Security Center. Um, AMD Catalyst, I think is what it is, and then uh, just a, a thing that shows you about uh, your graphics. Skype, Spotify, uh, the web desktop app, uh, a Canon printer program, and my Logitech mouse and keyboard program, and then Windows Action Center. And then right now running is Skype and Spotify. I'm not going to exit out of those because these are, this is what I usually, um, this is what I usually run all the time, uh, and it doesn't it really. It doesn't have that much of an impact on shutdown speeds or uh, really boot up times. So, uh, and if it does matter that much, then let me know in the comments, and I'll do another video without them running. So we're gonna go ahead and shut this down completely. So the monitor just went black, and then I'll tell you once my computer's fan light. Okay, my computer's fan light went down. The H, everything just went off the uh, LEDs. So it's completely off. Um, I'll let you know. I'll put a timer um, on that on the video uh, to let you know how long that was. So now I'm going to do the power on time. So you can kind of see the monitor in view and the computer in view, so I'm just going to go ahead and turn on the computer and then adjust the camera so that the uh, monitor works. So when I snap is when I hit the power button, just in case you can't see it, so I hit it. Right. Then. So there's the Asus logo. I don't have a password. So I, I just actually took one off. And then the Windows logo disappeared. And then we're in. We're in Windows. It was completely shut down. You know, I'm not doing any trickery. I shouldn't have to say that, but that's right. I'm just waiting for Skype and Spotify to boot up. Um, but sometimes I have issues with, um, not big issues, but um, there was Skype, by the way, and Spotify. Sometimes I have issues with, um, not having internet the first like 30 seconds of this some, at the most like now I was lucky with the internet being there as soon as I boot up um, but sometimes internet won't be there it's so fast um, so this is some, this is something I'm not really used to so that's why I'm just telling you guys alright guys thanks for watching my quick video on the SSD Kingston um, as, by the way this is 120 gigabytes forgot to mention that uh, it'll be in the title though um, so that I'll see you guys in the next video see ya What's up guys, and in this video I'm going to be giving you a review on the custom built AMD um, computer that I built myself, so let's get started.